Zelda IFL TV MTK Global with got promoter Frank Warren We're in the SSE Arena in Belfast today after a really successful show. Uh, quite exciting. Firstly, put it into your words. What what number of out of ten would you give this show, Frank? Well, I mean, it's, it's at least a nine. Um, it's, been, it's just a, maybe a, if, if Jamie Conner won, we'd have been a ten. It's, it's unfortunate he gave his all, but unfortunately it wasn't me tonight. But I thought it was a great show. It was good fights. I think it was uh, entertaining for the fans. You had a bit of everything. You had a sensational knockout with uh, Ted, Teddy. I mean, that was just the most amazing punch I think I've seen for, for a long, long time. You had uh, Paddy Barnes um, really, really showing that he's coming on and uh, winning another title. So you know, that'll stand him in good stead next year. And obviously, um, great undercard with some of some other good young, young kids on there and uh, did the business. And the man himself, Carl, he was in a very exciting fight against a very, very tough Mexican. And uh, I think he'd done exceptionally well. Congratulations to Carl Frampton. First time back out in the ring in 10 months. I know some cobwebs to get off. New changes have been made with, with Jamie Moore and yourself joining the party. Yeah. Are you pleased with the way he performed? Yeah, I mean, look, you know, I've got to be realistic. And I don't know sort of what I say to you. Yeah. It was a tough opponent. There, you can see there was uh, uh, there were moments in the fight where I'd prefer if Cole was being more defensive, but that's what he is. I mean, he's a tough guy himself, and uh, he did what he had to do. But those rounds are now rounds in the bank. He's had a been out of the ring for 10, 10 months, as you say. But more importantly, he's had a few problems outside the ring, as we all know, and uh, and with a new trainer. So it's all been a, quite a unique experience and an unusual experience for him. But he's come back, he's got all those demons behind him. And to say he's won, I thought he, I thought he, won, the, he, you know, he, he won the fight um, strongly, and more importantly, um, he set himself up for next year for some big fights. Heartbreak for Jamie Collin tonight. One of the nicest people you could ever oh. wish to meet, and hard-working, determined, gutsy man that you Jamie Collin. You know, really good, good guy. Um, got, you know, fabulous heart and gave his all. But he came up against somebody who uh, I think is quite a little bit special. Came up short against his head, Joe and Anchor Jazz. Yeah. He's travelled yeah. five of his defence, four of his fights have been yeah, on the it's road. Just, it's always going to be a tough fight, but you know that's the that's how Jamie is. He wanted his opportunity, we delivered it, and um, it wasn't the biggest night, but you know maybe in the future he might be able to come again. And do it again. The way that how determined Jamie Collin is, I wouldn't put anything past no. that man. He to get up after a couple of those body shots, no, no, no. we've seen no, lesser no, men fold from that sort correct. of stuff. Yeah. Paddy Barnes, great for him. He he will fight anyone anytime. The level of opposition we've seen him with, well well past someone of a five fight novice. Absolutely right. I mean that, that's dead on James. But the, but the thing about him is that um, he still needs experience. He may not think so. I I, I know so. <laughs> so he just needs to get, get more a bit more experience, which he will do. We'll keep him busy and, uh, and then get that. Now you've, you've got some great featherweights in the stable. You've got the likes of Josh Warrington. We know Lee Selby's out in action yeah. on the 9th of December. Yeah. Not to mention the Jackal, Carl Frampton. I yeah. mean, is the plan now to get these guys to fight one another? That's, is it? How does it? That's, what's going on? That's where we are. That's what we're trying to do. That's 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 the, that's the name of the game for us mm -hmm. to get these you know, to get these guys in against each other. Now you mentioned Windsor Park potentially for next summer for Carl Frampton. Is this? Is this something you guys have given serious thought to, or is it something that you no, sort of it's saw him with? No, I think we give it some serious, serious thought to, and that's, where, that's the direction we want to be going. Carl mm. Frampton, he seems like he's got a new bit between his teeth, a newfound hunger. Yeah. What have you, what have you found him like to be around thus far? I think he's been good. I mean, he gets on with it. He's a thorough pro, and uh, you know, a nice guy. I mean, I didn't really know him before this, but he's a nice guy. He's you know, not, you know, no complaints or whatever. And, uh, I think him and Jamie have struck a good relationship up, which is very important. But he's, he's been, been great, and, he's, and the fans love him. And, and you know why they love him, because that's how, that's how he is. It's, it's been a pleasure working with him. Now, as well as a star-studded list of boxers here today, we had one very special boxer in particular, Sol yeah. Canelo Alvarez, has come over to watch uh, his fight uh, in, in action. Um, did you have any time to spend with sort of with Canelo? Very, very, you know, not man. You know, we're busy and whatever, but we you know, we've talked and uh, you know, he's, he's, his English is fairly good. But you know, we spoke, spoke and talked about you know. Well, so your Mexican's pretty good as well. Well, you know that. <laughs> you know that. See. <laughs> 
<laughs> what did was Billy Joe Saunders and David Lemieux anything spoke about? Yeah, he that? took the arse when they saw him. He was talking about it. He thinks Bill's a good fighter. He said he's, you know, he, he favours Bill to win the fight, as I do. So let's hope that's going to be the case. And maybe get the fight with him down the road. Exciting times. Just a quick word on some of the prospects. Lewis Crocker, again, looked done fantastic. Well, the Croc. Yeah, four well, fights, four yeah, KOs, yeah, looking yeah, very yeah, impressive. Yeah, One to look out for. David Oliver Joyce as well. Done well, yeah. Very, yeah, very yeah. tough no, man. Done well, all the guys done well. Yeah, it's a good show tonight. I liked Gary Cully as well, so we did yeah, so, yeah. Uh, he, he did. I, I just think that we've got, um, you know, we've, we've been putting some really extremely, well, some extremely good promotions together. Good value for money for the fans. and... Uh, this is, uh, I'm pleased with this. We've had a good run. Good crop of fighters here in Belfast, a lot of talent. Yeah. Do you think this could be a hub for you in the future to well, develop? It, it, it is, and it, I don't think it's, it will be. I mean, we'll be back here again in, in uh, March, and we'll be doing the same thing again. Great win for Tommy McCarthy. Looking yeah. to see him, hopefully, in some big fights in the new year. Yeah. I want to touch on Tete time. None other than Zalani Tetti, one of the likable, most nicest oh, humans you could come across. He, he's guy. delivered again for you, hasn't he? he did, I mean, he's, 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 a, he's, a, he's just unbelievable. I think he's the best, best out there in his weight class. Um, and we would love to do the fight with uh, Ryan. Ryan Burnett, super WBA super love champion, him. IBF champion. Yeah. To get those two belts on the line against yeah. Zalani Tetti and his and we, WBO version we'll in yeah. Belfast could be great. Yeah, he's got home advantage. As realistic that fight can be made? I don't know, it's up to his management. We you know, we like I said earlier to somebody I said we're not you know, you're not pushing an open door with us. I said we you know, we took the door off the hinges, just come in and we're ready to go with it. We wanna make it. Thank one, well, thank you very much for giving me some time Thank today, you. sir. Always a great pleasure. I will Cheers, catch man. you soon. Thank you, mate.